Uh, as the taxes on the predatory lending network talking here. Now, um, the now the December unemployment report is out, and unemployment came in at 8.5 percent, and underemployment came in at 15.2 percent. What do you think about these numbers? They're horrible. I mean, people in America want jobs, and we can't find them. And a large amount of baby boomers are beginning to retire. Do you believe this is why the unemployment situation is improving? Well, since all the baby boomers are getting retired now, like none of our, for my retirement, it's not going to be there anymore. But the employment, yeah, it is getting. Now, uh, employment in sporting goods, hobbies, books, music, stores fell by 10,000 jobs. So in other words, 10,000 comic book people lost their jobs. What can be done to help these workers? Well, to find an efficient way to get new jobs and uh, to support them in some way or get people together and find a way or maybe even get a new president if that helps. <laughs> now the government numbers stop counting people as unemployed once they stop getting unemployment benefits. Some people believe the government numbers are closer to 11% of people being unemployed. Do you believe the government numbers? Not really. I mean, it's kind of hard to believe what the government says at times, but I'm pretty sure it could be at 11%. So in closing, is there any last minute things you'd like to say to the beings throughout the galaxy? Um, Kingdom Hearts is the best game ever. So in closing, this is Taxist from the Predatory Lending Network. Talk to you. Okay. Uh, this is Taxist from the Predatory Lending Network. Talking to you. Now, the December unemployment report is out, and unemployment came in at 8.5 percent. And underemployment came in at 18. Now, the unemployment rate came out, and unemployment's at 8.5 percent, and underemployment's at 15.2 percent. What do you think about these numbers? Um, I think they might be a bit off because um, we are currently well. It's probably uh, winter now, so a lot of people are getting out of the uh, how they say the part-time jobs for um, winter sales, so like holiday sales and all that. So it might be a bit off right now. Um, now a large number of baby boomers are beginning to retire. Do you believe this is why the unemployment situation is improving? Uh, could possibly. I mean, once um, someone leaves the position, there's always a position that needs to be open and positions need to be filled. Um, now, here's an interesting one too, is employment for sporting goods, hobbies, books, and music stores have fallen by 10,000 jobs. So it's 10,000 people in the comic book industry essentially lost their jobs. What can be done to help these workers? Uh, stop doing everything corporate. Um, it's a small business that makes this country great. And when everything goes corporate, unfortunately all the smaller guys end up getting kicked to the curve. Now another question that they have is uh, the government numbers stop counting people once they um, are no longer on unemployment benefits. Uh, and people believe that the actual number of unemployed is actually closer to 11%. So do you actually believe the government numbers? No, uh, all those figures are at best skeptical, so I wouldn't believe them. So in closing, is there any last minute things you'd like to say to the beings throughout the galaxy? Mm, not quite sure, so. <laughs> so in closing, this is Taxes from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Now, this is Taxes from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Now, the December unemployment report's out, and unemployment came in at 8.5%, and unemployment came in at 15.2%. Now, what do you think about these numbers? Definitely think it's a lot higher, but I'm, I'm glad to hear that it is improving. Um, definitely do hope that it had a lot to do with the economy slowly coming back around and, and smoothing itself out at the very least. One of the causes for that is people believe a large amount of baby boomers are beginning to retire and that's why the unemployment rate is improving. Do you actually believe that's why? It, it actually definitely makes a lot of sense. I mean, my parents are roughly actually about that age and they actually just have retired. So because of that, it did free up their positions that in their current employment. So I, I definitely do believe that that has a definite influence on it. And recently, employment in sporting goods, hobbies, books and music stores fell by 10,000 jobs. So in other words, you know, a lot of people in the comic book industry lost their jobs. Uh, what can be done to help these workers? That, that's definitely a difficult one because the, the, a lot of people who don't have a lot of free income at the current time aren't spending it on those types of things, so therefore it kind of affects that market. Hopefully as the market itself improves, you know, people will have more free money to go ahead and give to those, their hobbies again. And, uh, now, the government numbers stop counting people once they stop getting unemployment benefits. And some people believe that the government numbers are wrong and we're actually closer to 11% unemployment. Do you actually believe the government numbers? 
Definitely not. I, I do know a lot of people don't claim unemployment either just because they're unemployed. So that should also be taken into account. People who don't actually even get unemployment but are unemployed, therefore don't count as an unemployed type of uh, status. So definitely I would think it's, it is higher, but it kind of is one of those difficult things to track. So in closing, is there any last minute things you'd like to say to the beings throughout the galaxy? Um, no, but uh, that's, uh, that's definitely an awesome mask. It's a cool mm -hmm. So in closing, this is Taxis from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Now this is Taxis from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Now the December unemployment reports out and unemployment came in at 8.5% and underemployment came in at 15.2%. What do you think about these numbers? I think it shows the economy is clearly improving. It's, it sucks that the underemployment rate is still that low because if it was a lot higher, the economy can get a lot better. Okay. Uh, now a large amount of baby boomers are beginning to retire. Do you believe this is why the economy is improving? It could be one of the reasons, but I hear that the, the, the government is giving out 200,000 jobs sometime this year. So I think it's a little bit because of that and because the government is doing some stuff to help it out. Now, um, employment in sporting goods, hobbies, books, and music stores fell by 10,000 jobs last month. Um, what can be done to help these workers? I don't know. I mean, may, if the government could do something, maybe about increasing these places that are sold, maybe like getting, not the government doing this, but everyone getting the news out, don't go so much digital, stick with like paperback stuff and going to stores and buying it in person. Because these stores are all going down because of that. Now, the government numbers stop counting people once they lose their unemployment benefits. And some people believe the actual number of unemployed is closer to 11%. Do you actually believe the government numbers? Of course not. I mean, why, why would we believe that just because they say it is, that it really isn't? It's going to be a lot higher than that. Trust me, there's so many people who aren't even, like, recorded about the government. So I, I do not believe those numbers. So in closing, is there any last-minute things you'd like to say to the beings throughout the galaxy? Um, not really. So I'm having a great time at this con, but... Especially with the economy, hopefully for the years will get better, especially for us young people who need jobs later in life. So in closing, this is Taxes from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you. Uh, this is Taxes from the Predatory Lending Network talking to you here. Now the December unemployment report is out and unemployment came in at 8.5% and underemployment came in at 15.2%. What do you think about these numbers? That act, Those act numbers actually suck because... 8 and 15% is actually real small in comparison to how many people do not have jobs in general or just not working in general or just working like a couple of hours in general, you know. People can't live off that. They just can't. They, they got houses and apartments to pay for. They got cars and kids, you know. It's, it really sucks that that many people are sitting there, you know, not being able to, it's not that they don't want to do it, it's just that they, there's certain things that are not allowing them to do it. Now, a large amount of baby boomers are beginning to retire, and many people believe this is why the unemployment situation is improving. Do you actually believe that's the reason? No, because retirement is completely different to supplement from than it would be, to, let's say, derived from federal and state tax. You know, the, the baby boomers were already set, even though, yeah, they did kind of rob us for a generation, but in the end, their money is their money, and our money is our money, and right now, our money is very scarce. Now, uh, last month, employment in sporting goods, hobbies, books, and music stores fell by 10,000 jobs. So roughly 10,000 people in the comic book industry lost their jobs last month. What can be done to help these workers? What could I have done? What can people do to help these 10,000 people who lost their jobs? Well, buy stuff. <laughs> You know, I mean, everybody's so into, excuse me, trying to, you know, pirate stuff and try to get over without having to actually just pay. You pay because you're not only paying the people that are making it, you're paying the people who are paying the people who are making this. And that's a lot of money. So if we actually buy stuff, pay for stuff. I mean, if it, even if it's discounted a little bit, you know, just pay for it because in the end it helps them survive. Now um, the government numbers uh, stop counting people once they stop getting unemployment benefits and many people believe that the actual number of unemployed is actually closer to 11 percent. So do you actually believe the government numbers? Yes and no only because the government likes to manipulate but only for the interests of 
either them or the country. It just really depends. Um, the number could probably change tomorrow. We just never really know. But the whole fact of the matter is, is that the problem itself is apparent. So apparent, in fact, that some places that people are really used to going to for shopping are no longer in business or they are being taken over by or be emerged by other businesses and even then it's not really you know not really helping that much which is really sad so in closing is there any last minute things you'd like to say to the beings throughout the galaxy if you need help Goku is right here because he is the savior of the planet he's died twice for you guys and he's a super nice guy. So in closing, this is Taxis from the Predatory Lending Network. Talk to you.